Okay, so Mario Strikers Battle League has been out for a couple of days now. I've played the game, and well, I was fairly disappointed. But anyways, I'll be talking about how Nintendo disrespected Mario Strikers Battle League. Alright, I'm going to begin with some positives, like how the basic gameplay is so smooth and very amazing. The matches are very fast paced and very chaotic, which pumps you up with a lot of adrenaline like you're on crack. The soundtrack slaps, you would have thought Kanye West was in the studio with Mozart. And the game is just so graphically amazing with all the effects that they put into it. But Nintendo still somehow fumbled the bag, while everything is so perfect with this game. There's still a lot of missing stuff, like Mario sports games usually always have a lot of missing stuff but even mario golf and mario tennis had a full-on story mode i don't know why this game doesn't it just really doesn't make any sense in mario striker battle league there are quick matches which are fun but after a while i don't know how you can still play them it's like if you just play play now on 2k you can do cup battles which are fun because they get harder as you continue them but you can still get really bored doing those over and over again the online aspect is what you would expect it's just ranked battles playing against others all over over the world it's not that bad but you better hope you don't lag a lot one good thing about online battles are that the servers are actually pretty good in this game which i was surprised because usually nintendo online servers aren't that good but not only is this game missing the single player elements the character choices are so basic and two less than the original from 2007. now with modern nintendo we can just assume that there will be paid or free dlc for new characters in the future and possibly game modes for this game. Honestly, you can't blame Nintendo for everything since this game was made by Next Level Games. But maybe, since usually their games are usually really juiced up with content, but this game just isn't the case for them. It's an off game for them. Well, I think this game is really a work in progress that needs some major fixes to be a top tier Nintendo game. If they fix these issues, we might have a really good game on our hands. And if they decide not to fix this game, well, they are pretty much screwed because like, honestly, they, I feel like this game could honestly profit so much money since soccer is such a globally liked sport. And I feel like if they actually do fix these problems, this game's gonna take off. Nintendo is gonna make money anyway, so they probably won't care that much. But either way, I will see you guys in the next video.